You know, my son is getting older and we're approaching the time where we're gonna have to have the talk. I mean, there's a real battle going on out there for the hearts and minds of our children. We decided to be more proactive and intentional with our daughter. My father instilled in me this passion and his father before him. I feel tremendous pressure to get this right. All you can hope for is that they remember everything they were taught. It's important to start young when building a foundation. So when the hard times hit, they won't stray. They will remain faithful. It's never too early to introduce your kids to your favorite sports team. We live in Dallas, so a lot of the kids on the playground are cowboy fans. We're gonna try to keep her cowboy free as long as possible. I had her yelling Lakers when she was still in the womb. This is a legacy that I wanna pass down to my kids, my grandkids, my great-grandkids, my great-grandkids, grandkids, you know, if the world still exists. There are a few very important things that he needs to know before growing up. One, that Michael Jordan is the best to ever play the game, hands down. I don't want my son to grow up in a world where LeBron James is the greatest of all time. I mean, six championships, in the discussion. The Cowboys cheat, the Cowboys killed SpongeBob, whatever it takes to get this idea out of her head that the Cowboys are cool, I will do it. If it means dressing up like a cowboy and scaring her in the middle of the night with a chainsaw, I will do it. I don't want to have to force it on her, but let's face it, I'm going to have to. It's the Royals we're talking about. I have a daughter, but hey, who said it was going to be easy? It's all about being intentional. All you have to do is plant the seed. As a Red Sox fan, I, I really want to teach him. Hey, Dad, Mom needs you downstairs. You know, I, I didn't start early enough with that one. I wish I had. Could I accept my son liking another team besides mine? No, I couldn't. Does that make me a bad father? No, it makes me a great father.